Nelson Mandela Bay Metro is up for grabs in the upcoming local government elections and the DA is hoping to win first place. The party led the 2016 local government election coalition in that metro after falling short of winning a majority. News from Africa, Sipa Kema has that story. Past partnerships have become a lesson learned for the Democratic Alliance. A coalition government is the furthest idea from the party's plan to govern the Nelson Mandela Bay Metro. It's politics, much like soccer, you play to win the match, you don't play for the penalty shootout. If there's a penalty shootout afterwards, then you, you can participate in that. We're going out like any other political party would normally do and say, give us a majority. We want to be able to do what we've done in a uh, municipality, the best run municipality in the Eastern Cape now by uh, the independent report. We want to do that in Nelson Mandela Bay. I think the Bay is at five years of instability, government coming in, being removed by the coalition of corruption, coming trying to pick up the pieces again. I think what the Bay needs more than anything is stability in its politics so we can start to develop and grow, create jobs for people, keep people safe, and ensure that we can see the Bay growing uh, into the future. While the DA is pushing for a majority win, smaller parties are mushrooming. During the party's manifesto launch in the Nelson Mandela Bay, party leaders spoke against the small parties. But now, the party says it's not concerned. Like the mayor said, they were there in 2011, they sprung up again in 2016, they spring up again now. Do you know when is the next time you will see them? In 2026. That will be the next time that you, you, see, you will be sitting here and ask the same question again uh, about these parties. They don't exist. And we have said very clearly and our people understand, a vote for any small party is a vote for the ANC. If you want to bring the ANC back into government, vote for a small party. It wouldn't be a DA campaign without a jab thrown at the ANC, who have been run out from some areas while campaigning. Mr. May, you don't see me being chased out of communities. Not at all. Yeah, what are we doing? You don't see me being booed in the Free State and all these places. Only yeah, exactly. The gloves are off for the Nelson Mandela Bay Metro, with political parties intensifying their campaigns in this metro. Over the weekend, three other political parties will be seen heading out on their campaigns, hoping to win the metro. While the ANC president, Sol Ramaphosa, will be staging a second return in two weeks. For Newsroom Africa, Channel 405, I am Sipa Kema in Kabecha.